I just want to say a massive thank you to Nokia for sending me their new stealth phone. It's got an amazing anti-theft device. You know, you know you've hit the big time when these big companies are sending you their new phones. So thank you very much. But I do need to make a quick call. Hang on. Hello, Jared. How's it going, mate? Yeah, I, I just um, wanted to congratulate you on your Young Player of the Month award. It's good to see you sort of, you know, really improving in the side. Thanks a lot, Gaffer. I'm very excited and happy to have won the Player of the Month award. I've um, been working very hard on the training pitch and on the pitch. Uh, uh, just a sort of quick question, because I'm just sort of tinkering with the tactics and stuff. Where would you sort of, what would be your perfect position on the football pitch? You know, where would you see your ideal position to play? You know, I think my, my best role is on the right wing. You know, I'm left footed, so that inside forward role and support is perfect for me. So, yeah, thanks for the award and long may it continue. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, we, yeah, we can definitely accommodate that. All right. I'll see you. I'll see you in training tomorrow. Yep. Yeah. yeah, all right. Love you. Love you. Love you. You put, you put the phone. You put. Fuck has hung up. <laughs> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back to the Stanley Parable. It's the 29th of December. It's the January transfer winner. We've got some good news, though, and we've got some bad news. The bad news is the form, but actually not too bad. We played against Shrewsbury, who were actually pretty decent, but we held our own, and we had a late own goal, which was just a big, sc like, scramble. Like, a, watching the under-8s team from a corner, everybody just went to the ball, and it popped into the back of the net. But we played all Watson. Niall Watson got himself another goal, um, and then we drew 0-0 with Peterborough, and we were... We played superbly well. The just the guys just didn't put in, just didn't finish the ball. We had three or four good chances, and they just weren't finishing. So, it is what it is. It doesn't look great. Four games without a win, but we're still eighth in the league, boys. Remember, we're relegation favourites, so we're still doing all right. The other bit of good news is because I've like as I said at the beginning of the save, I've never played a director of football challenge before. But there's a couple of bits that have come up that have made me feel at rest. I forgot, you know, just before the. January transfer window that you get that screen that pops up that says all the contracts that are running out. I can ask my director of football to renegotiate new contracts. So I've done it for, he hasn't done it yet. So we, God knows what he's going to pay people. Um, he hasn't actually done it yet, but I've asked him to renegotiate a bunch of the new contracts. A few players I've just said, you know, I haven't said anything. I don't know whether he's going to come in and still do some of the renewals that I didn't ask for because it is his job. It's set up in his staff responsibilities for him to do that. So we'll find out. Also, there's other stuff because obviously uh, Barlays is about to go back on the 2nd of, of February, right? Or oh, January, sorry. And we really want to. And there is the option um, to add as a transfer target. OK. And it only says transfer. I'm, I, I, I'm guessing that it says transfer right now because the loan window isn't open. I'm hoping because we can't afford him. Right. He's he's far too expensive. He's 650K. We have no money whatsoever. Well, I want to get him in back in on loan. So I'm hoping come the 1st of January when the loan list that, that this will be in existence. So we can edge him towards signing a player and hope for the best, which is. Thank God for that, because he's, he's been nowhere to be seen. I might have to give him a call tomorrow, because it's just turning into a bit of a joke. He said, like, you know, I've, I got one, I've had one email since we last talked, uh, like, since we spoke to him last on the phone, and he was just saying, yeah, I'm on it, mate. And that was it. And I'm like, well, that doesn't actually fix anything. So today's episode's going to be an unusual one. We're going to play the Brighton game, and but I'm going to go through the entire month. OK, so I'm just going to sort of I want to show you the Brighton game and then we'll probably show one of the other games and then I'll just tell you what happened in the other ones and stuff like that. But there's hopefully there'll be a few goings on like possible transfers. We never know if a big team's going to come in. Jared does need a rest. I've said I'm going to rest him. And he said he did need it. So um, I, I, I also on the game, Jared is the Welsh under 21 international. He has no links to Wales whatsoever, um, <laughs> but he's doing all right. So maybe, you know, try and find a Welsh granny, Jared. It might work for you. Right, OK. And thank you again for doing the bit, mate. You're an absolute superstar. Right, OK. So we're going to see how it looks. See? 
Two of those I don't care about leaving, but the others I want to go. So we're going to go to the 1st of January. This might be a long episode, lads. I'll edit out, like, try and edit out some of the bits and stuff. Um, yeah, post-match analysis. Yeah, I always study that closely. No. <clears throat> I want to see if my hunch is correct. Okay, so I did that because he had a, a triggered extension. So I was like, yep, I'm having that. He's the good youngster. So we triggered his extension. I've got about four, I think about four other players he's supposed to be renewing the contract of. <clears throat> I'm hoping they come up. And we can also, like I can say, um, buh, 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 buh. like for instance, I can go on to, what the fuck is this? Oh my god, he's suggesting players to me. Well, you do the signings, you dickhead. Don't suggest them to me. If you think they're right, go for them. Like, say, for instance, this guy, Lloyd Isgrove, I can go to um, add as a transfer target, and he will try and secure that transfer. So we can use that as well. Um, I did accidentally do it for Barley's up. Uh, but he just said there's no chance. What is this? Okay. I don't know how we're going to play this. Do we... Because I don't want to just be sitting there suggesting all the transfers. Because then it feels like I'm in a bit too much control. We can do one or two. But if he's suggesting... Then I feel like we should then go... All right. No matter how good or bad they are. If you can reckon you can sign him, go for it. What sort of... Like, oh, we got a winger, a goalkeeper, a midfielder... A striker. Oh, yeah, he's covering the bases. And a midfielder. I feel like I'm... I'm going to do it. So, I'm just going to do this. What if he tries to sign all of them? This is the problem, though, boys. <laughs> We're learning as we go. Like I said, I've never done a, <laughs> this. Is he going to sign all of them on loan? <laughs> I think a lot of those aren't going to come for us. Right, I want to see the first, so I can suggest loaning back Barlazer. We might even have to wait until he's gone. Before we get him back. I have no idea how any of this works. <clears throat> We're going to get the bloody Bradford game before we know, innit? We face the impossible. I get that message a lot. It's like they don't know we're eighth in the league, doesn't it? Like, And we've beaten a bunch of teams already this season. But that's fine, game. That's fine. <clears throat> Come on. Do something useful, Gusto. Here we go. Confident. I just dread to think what the wages are going to be like. I don't think you can see wages of a previous contract, can you? Like, you can't see somebody's contract history. Not that I know of. Okay, so it's it's that we got the League One open, right? Transfer window. So if we go to... just to make, So we've got all these players possibly loaned, so we know it's open. Jesus, three and a half million. He'll come, really? Oh, God. Overrated much? Um... So, if we go... What was I doing? Anybody? Anybody idea? Yes. Squad. Bar laser. Okay. Transfer. Add as transfer. Is it... Because we can't sign him. I think his contract might run out at the end of the season. Okay. Well, okay. We'll skip the head of the game. And hopefully on the second, when he leaves, we'll get him back. That's the plan. Oh, hang on. Don't know who this person. This wasn't one of the ones, was it? It's a fullback. Uh, I might just. I'm tempted just to not do transfer targets and just let him decide that. I'll off tell him to do contract renewals, like I'll say, suggest. But I'm, I'm tempted. He's not bad physicals, but all right. Another thirty-year-old. Good stuff. Okay, are we going to play a game or are you just going to sign people? Right, we're going. I'll, pl I'll see you after the Bradford game, hopefully, unless there's more weird shit Gusto's been up to. So we played against uh, Bradford and we drew one all. It was decent. Uh, Seamus Connolly with a 91st minute equaliser. Nice for us to get the late goals for a change. Um, we looked, we played, we were the better team, but we looked a bit blunt because we were resting Jared and Barley's up. So without them, it's, it's a bit ropey, lads. Like you don't see that sort of. Skill up front is what I'm looking for. But we go on. 2nd of January now. 
Barlaze is about to leave us. I don't know why I'm resting Barlaze or is he's about to leave us. That's fucking... I should have just played him to death. Oh! Oh! What did he offer him? Jordan Clark, please! Gusto! He's one of our better players, you dickhead! He's wanted as well! By Sunderland! <sighs> okay, what... This one I was... I, I wanted to offer him a new... Con I, I told him to go and offer him a new contract. He's not great, but he's just been performing so well for us this season. I thought we could use him as a backup. I'm not too bothered. He's 33 now. But I'm, that's dodgy about the clock. I'll, I'll wait a few weeks and ask him again, because... Oh, do we see what he offers him? Because that would be interesting. Like, is he, he's on 950. Did he offer him, like, 300 quid a week and a bag of chips? Like, how did... Oh, that's a bum, isn't it? Okay, come on. There was a couple. I think there was one or two more. But I want to see if we can get a bar laser. And I checked on the transfer list, and we can add someone to the loan list. Oh, you're a... No, no, what are you offering them, mate? What are you offering them? Okay, Barlaze is now gone. Okay, transfer, transfer target, loan. Come on. Urgent. It's urgent. Please, don't fuck this up. But after what's just happened, I'm going to have to call him. Hang on. Hello, Gusto. Hello, mate. Yeah, hi, mate. Yeah, I was just wondering, like, I've just, I'm just i seeing these contracts come in and they're rejecting contracts. Like, what's going on? Are you sitting down with the players and, you know, thrashing it out? Like, it doesn't seem to be working, whatever you're doing. Yeah, mate, I'm doing all the business, man. Yeah, putting the airs in. Yeah, but, okay, so what, what are you looking... Like, are you going to see the guys? Like, where are you at the moment? Are you in the office? Uh, no, mate. Oh, well, you, you've got to get in the office, mate. What about the bitches? I don't care about the bitches. Leave the bitches alone. Just get in the office. Get down to some absolute work. I'll tell. I'll tell your grandmother. I'll tell Beatrice. Oh, 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 hey, 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 no need for that. No need for that. I'll get in the office. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Bye. Dickhead. What an absolute dickhead. Oh, this is not going well, boys. Okay. Oh, he's my scout. Good. Uh, you, you can do the same with staff, so I asked them to give new contracts to a couple of the players. Well, at least he's got somebody. That's that's hopefully a better sign. Are we going to get this left back in? This 30-year-old left back? Okay, we have... Okay, good and bad news. Connolly's turned it down. My <laughs> under-18s manager has, has signed a new deal. Um... Max Ted, our backup goalkeeper's turned down a deal. Okay, the physio's turned, got a new deal. He seems to be going to do staff, but we have made an offer for Barlazer. He's gone in with a classic 0-0. Zero, zero. Let's hope for the best. Oh, we have a new signing, my friends. Anua Abassi has come into the club. He's not a horrific two and a half star. It's kind of where we thought we were last time. It's all his signings he's making are from America. <laughs> What's going on? Well, he's made two signings, both are from America. Okay, let's get McConville to welcome him. Okay. We do need depth there, so it's not horrific, okay? The fans are unsure. I'm with you there, fans. Um, solid defensive base. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <sighs> Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, let's go to the Brighton game. We're going to watch this one because this is a big game and we might get spanked. He's got, oh, apparently he's got a great, he wouldn't know respect if it slapped him in the face and called him George. Okay. he's well, At least he's pleased with it. Good, good news. Right, okay. I don't know whether we should play Bowen. I'm not going to play him, I don't think, because we're probably, I know this is maybe pessimistic, lads. But he does need a rest. Oh, the bid's been rejected. Oh. Um. Oh, okay, that's not Gusto's fault. Suddenly now, fucking Barlaza, pew pew, it's too good for us little Stanley team, according to their 
Twatty Manager. Okay, Niall Watson, 10. Nice one, mate. Good. Okay. Oh, yeah, I think we're going to rest Jarrett Bowen. I think it. he does need that. He's only had one game rest, and that's not usually enough if they're, if they're needing a rest. So we're just going to have to suffer this without our two best players. Oh, okay. Um, okay, we might be able to get him. I think his contract, he's got a year and a half left. He's, he's not that good. That he, come on, Newcastle. That's, that's a, such a dick move. Who the fuck's Regan Ogle? What? Why do I care? Oh, because he's in my... He's, I own him. Oh, that's why. Okay, well, he can go. He's not very good. Uh, <laughs> who is this guy? <laughs> that's going to make him feel good, isn't it? He's hoping to break into the first team one day, and I have no idea who he is. Excellent stuff. Okay, Brighton. <sighs> I might just rest everybody. No, that's really bad, isn't it? There's a chance, boys. They might they might get complacent with this. Okay, so Bowen's going to be continue to be left out. Get another. Oh, he's up to five stars now, boys. Nobody's interested in him, which is fantastic. Uh, no, no offense, Darren. Nobody wants you, but no offense. Like literally, no one in the world. No, no offense, though. <laughs> right. Okay. I suppose we, we do need another centre back as well because the other guy just left as well, didn't we? He wasn't that good, to be fair. Right. Um, do we play the thirty-two-year-old Mark Hughes? Can Callum Johnson play centre back? Not really. Harvey Rogers can though. Okay, okay. He was our sort of no-nonsense fullback, so we can go to to Callum Johnson can play there. Oh, we've lost our left back as well. He must have known. He must have known. That's good. Good move. I'm, I'm going to put him straight in. <laughs> Away to Brighton on your debut, mate. Good luck with that. Right. <laughs> oh dear, boys. We've been weakened. I feel. I, I. I said this before. We needed to get as many points on the board because I wasn't sure that he was going to do. Gusto was going to do bits. Turns out he's not doing bits. No bits have been done. Um. Mark Hughes can go on the bench. Jared Bowen can... Okay, we're going to... Anybody in the under-18s fancies a bit of game? He's already leaving, isn't he? Oh, I could have done with him, to be fair. Look, 25-year-old centre-back. Oh, that's a dick. That's a pain in the dick. Right, Souza, can we bring you back? He is transfer listed, but I'm starting to regret my decision. And Will Wood, who's a decent fullback, can we recall you? I'm allowed to do that, aren't I? I'm not doing it. Ogles there, Zeh Mohammed, Souza. Probably just don't need you actually. I'm not that desperate, mate. No offence. Scott Brown needs a rest as well. We're lacking a little bit in the central midfield department now. Um, it would. It's going to have to be Sam Finley. But then can Connolly tackle nine and nine for marking and tackling? That's good enough for a ball-winning midfielder. Oh, Finley's a natural ball-winning midfielder. Ten and seven. Yeah. All right, then, mate. Sounds good to me. Right. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> I'm going to give Zanzella another game. He started to drop off the form. He had a little run of performances. Auto number. Lovely. Little run of performances, but he's he's dropping off a little bit. I don't expect too much from him here. Let's have a look at their striker. £18 million. Pounds. All right, let's move on. Okay. Play without any pressure. Okay, good. Oh, this could be ugly. This could be ugly. Maybe this tactic is suited perfectly. Flat back four, no nonsense stuff going on. How's old? Uh... Oh, 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 cheeky back heel. Knees it away. Is a queer though. Cuts back. Oh, dunk. Oh, I've actually heard of these players. I don't like it. Come on, that was the highlight, surely. Oh, he's done well. Good save, Max Ted. Pluckage, son. Pluckage, top pluckage. <clears throat> Come on. Yeah, Zanzella's... Yeah. Abassi. I want to see how he does. 6.7 currently. I'll take that all day long, lads. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right. We haven't given up a clear-cut chance, which is, which is kind of the big deal here. Is not giving away big chances. 
They're going to pepper us. Oh, that's another set piece. Easy win for Sykes. Cannot cart. And Done does... Oh, just to whip one in. Ooh, hanging on, boys. 20 minutes gone. Encourage. They're fired up. Okay. At some point, we do have to try and score, though. If we want to... Oh, there it is. There it is. It's a half chance, lads. Hey? We're getting FM'd. I can't believe this. We're so unlucky. <laughs> We're so unlucky. They've had eight long shots. This is what we want. We want them... To want us to be really hard to break down and then hopefully a set piece some little scrappy thing I think we'll bring on um, Billy Key for the second half use his experience <laughs> 21 shots fuck get a tough time boys what a performance lads what a defensive performance that is Woo! Ross Sykes has won uh, has both won and lost possession more than any other player that's really helpful advice isn't it um, uh, Billy Key for the second half. Hopefully going for that extra experience. Um, everybody else is relatively fit as it's going to take. All right, I'm going to say passionate. We No, not we've been, been the better team. I know we're on Ducks, but I'm going to say I'm happy. I'm bloody delighted, lads. <clears throat> right, come on. How's... Uh, Abassi doing 6.5. That's not too bad for, for what we're doing at the moment. <laughs> I'll take it. Two shots on target. 100% record. Can't believe we haven't scored. The game hates me, lads. They've had eight shots on target. That's fine. Come on, boys. Just one little breakaway. That's all we're looking for. This is a proper lower league performance. Hang on for Grim Death. Oh, I can feel a penalty coming on. No. Oh, he's knocked it over. Come on. We're still in with a chance here. What about a replay? I'll take a replay. Take them back to our place. A bit more cash monies. Oh, no. Every highlight's a bit scary at this point. Come on, win it, win it, win it. No, he's a quiddo. Just runs at the defence. Kale. Not the vegetable. Not cart. Solly March. Yes! Go on, break. Jump for the ball. Jump for the ball. Please, dry gun. That's it. Uh, hoof it away. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Go on, pounce! Pounce! Oh, he can't even win it off him. Oh, I thought that was the moment, lads. To be fair, I was watching the defenders thinking if he does win this ball, he's still not got the pace to just run through on goal. He's going to get caught up. But it gave him a chance, and they rifled it. They get they're they're panicking here, lads. I'm going to gamble praising them. <sighs> Overwhelmed. Thirty shots. <clears throat> As the team doing, anybody falling apart yet? I, I, I'm tempted to bring Jared Bowen on. <gasps> Do we? No. He's had a game rest and 70 minutes. Jared, we need you, man. We can have a rest after. You could potentially be the guy. I'm playing you where you want it to be. Inside forward. All right? On the right-hand side. Um, Finley's having a bit of a mare, but that's to be expected. We can't really do anything about that. Um, I think we might bring the giant Ben Richards Everton on for Bassey. He's overwhelmed. It's his debut. He, he's lacked match sharpness. It was a horrible game to throw him into. <clears throat> I'm going to say, I feel like Encourage just is rubbish. Look, Encourage. Okay, it's just worked. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. <clears throat> Yes, cause an injury. Have they made all their subs? No. God damn. No, they haven't, they? No. <laughs> Can't do numbers. Come on, boys. We've deserved this. Yeah? This is the big important thing. They've only had two decent chances. Oh, don't. Don't do it. Brighton, don't do it. You're in the Premier League. You don't need this. You don't need this. Oh, why are you saying? Oh, because he was our oh, touch. Fair enough. Try to keep it in. This is it. Defend it, boys. Defend it. Like your heart. Come on. No! <sighs> right. This this is probably impossible to do. Um, you swap. Um, oh, fuck up all brown on us and a Bowen. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> I can see when the, when I do something really stupid, all I see is the comments. All I see is the future comments calling me a dick. <sighs> okay, it's okay. Oh, that was the last sub as well. Fuck. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We've used all our subs, haven't we? Yeah, McConville. Okay. So we have to make this work. Okay. Um, Connolly can go out there. Finley can go out there. Is a winger. Oh, bollocks. Okay. Uh, okay, okay. No, we can make this work. That'll do. Don't look at the giant black holes next to the positions. So That's fine. Yeah. Um, and we want to go wing back attack. Oh my god, that centre back's going on wing back attack. It's not a good sign, is it? All right, go boys. Go. I forgot to take it off. Cautious. Oh, we did so well. We did so, so well. Oh, I can't even click the button. It's a highlight. It's a highlight. We have the ball. Oh, God. He's just lobbed it in, hasn't he? Go on. Touch it. Touch it. Oh, I thought he going to... Come on. Come on. Come on. Pressure him. Pressure him. Where's that going? Straight to their player. Wow, they're like good at football and they can pass and stuff, aren't they? Keeper, 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 go get it! Fucking hell, man! What are you doing? Oh, well, don't be dickheads. Free Edda, Max Ted catches. Well done, boys. That is not bad against the Premier League team. The trouble is, it's like a what if. If Bowen had actually been subbed on as the inside forward instead of Brown. They both could be picking with B, though, lad. All right. It's really confusing. <laughs> I'm going to say no. Good effort, lads. Fucking amazing effort. Oh, dear. I can't believe it. He might have scored, though, mightn't he? He might have scored. <sighs> he could have broken his leg as well if he'd subbed on Bowen. So, think of it that way. Oh, dear. Oh, <laughs> dear. <laughs> right, okay. we got Will Wood. Right, straight in. Might need a left back. Um, we can, what we could do, because we've got this Danny Williams guy who's just picking up 800 quid. We, we can add him to the unwanted list. Sell for any price, mate. Just get what you can, yeah? If you can get some like nice and spicy knickknacks and a box of Jaffa cakes, I'll take it. All right? Oh, bum. We battled, lads. We battled. All right. That's all we can ask of us. Let's help the money situation a little bit. Projections now slightly not as bad. Okay. We'll go a few more days and see how we get on. Any news? I'll come back. Oh, Gusto's Gusto's doing business, boys. He's doing business. Um, downs. Okay. Oh, I'm scared to look. I'm scared to look. I want him to be a centre mid because we were really low on centre mids. Okay, it's a loan offer for a centre mid. One appearance, one goal. Flynn Downs. Decent, boys. Come on, Gusto. He's coming through for us, lads. Yeah, we're going to... I think the rule is I'm not allowed to say, oh, go and buy this player because I think that's all like... You know, we'll let Gusto do transfers... Um, I will suggest contract renewals and stuff like that. And I still can't do contract renewals, but I suggest them to him. Or if we've got a player on loan like we did with Barlazer to go out and extend the loan. But I can't suggest new players to come in. We're just going to have to go with what we've got. But that is decent, boys. If he comes to us, that would be absolutely fantastic. We've got space for a few loanies. Okay, good news, boys. Good news. Off to Gillingham. Away to 23rd. We need to turn the form around now because it's getting... Not worrisome, but just edgy, you know. But I feel like we've played well in the league games that we've had, even despite the results. So I'm hoping we can just go into this, pick up a little win. Oh, God, what we've got now. It's been accepted. Good stuff. 
Um, all right, that's not too bad. He's going to be playing probably. So 775 quid. I'll take that. Okay, we'll go through this game. Um, I'm bringing Billy Key back in. Jared Bowen's coming back in. The Conville's going to go on this left-hand side. He is a right footer, but if I said I promised Jared I'd play him in his preferred position. So we're going to go with that. He's fine. Um, oh, I already missed Barley's. I miss him, guys. I miss him. we got Will Wood, so he can replace Danny Williams on the bench. Um, 6.79 is not bad for a fullback that plays defensively. Uh, Sykes, nobody's playing well in defence at the moment. We have conceded a few goals, but he could do with the rest. That This is... Okay, we're going to try him at centre back. He can play centre back. They're double figures, just, just about double figures. So we're going to play him at centre back. He's not too bad. He's got 15 jumping reach, so it's only really there. He probably is a better centre back. We'll give him a go. Um, do we want to bring Jordan Clark's back? And he is the king of the assists. Um, but you're another righty, aren't you? That's the problem. But we can play him as the number ten if we need to go that way. Uh, Scott Brown's back fit. So he can come in. That's good news. Connolly's done a fine job, like I was saying, fi filling, in, filling in as the Mazella. It's just we don't have any backup for him now. Okay, so, Darren, this is the position you wanted to play. This is the position you were born for. All right, Willwood, number 20, smashing it. Okay, I want to see Darren do bits this game. He did actually win Player of the Month for November, or Young, young Player of the Month. Um... Um, oh god recent form 22nd okay not they can give a shit about that probably don't understand those big numbers do they right <clears throat> here we go here we go Jared I want to see you doing bits alright let's bring up this league table oh don't start sliding lads don't start sliding Okay, as always, starting off with our flat, very flat back four. He's everybody starts off six point seven, so we're looking. I'm looking for a seven from you today. If you even if you don't score, Jared. <clears throat> Come on, are we gonna see anything? Here we go. Here we go. No, 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 no. Starting, I'm starting to worry, boys. Oh, okay. <clears throat> We're going to go more positive second. I've got, okay, okay possession. We've created a half chance. But they're getting too many, too many chances. Connolly's got another. He does like a yellow card. Oh, no. Brownie's picked up a knock. Why? I can't. I don't have many players to replace him. We're going to go to half time. I might switch it up into the more attacking version, and then he can he can come off. He's recovering. What's wrong with him? Foot. His foot's fallen off. He's lost a toe somewhere on the pitch. He's lost a toe. All right. Okay. Half time. Nil nil. We've been. This is the most disappointing performance of recent weeks. Um, look, they're a shit team, boys. They're a shit team. Okay. So we switch to this one. Brown does need to come off, though. So Nolan can go into the ball. Yeah, so this is, makes much more sense now. That's the way to do it. Um, Finn, actually... Actually... Hello, game. Hello. Can I not undo that game? Did I not take it? Put it... I'm having a brain fart. I'm having a proper brain fart. Where's the undo button? Where's the fucking undo button? <laughs> Am I going mental? <laughs> I'm getting fucking okay, mental. Yeah, they, yeah, we'll go with that. That's what I meant to do. <clears throat> right, bit more positive now, guys. Let's go for them. Play them at their own game. What we can do is bring on Will Wood. 
because he's a more attacking version. Come on, boys. That's it. That's it. How's our centre-back doing? Abassi. 6.5. I've seen worse. Let's go for get creative. O'Neill, free kick. It's a tricky one. Ooh, keeper saves it. Didn't look the most convincing, but he's keeping it out, Max Ted. Come on. Oh, lads. Lads, lads, lads. Oh, another set piece. Free header. Bollocks on a stick. Oh, far too easy. You absolute lemons. I'm skipping this shit. I don't want to see it again. I just don't want to see it again. Fuck off. Okay, so since going more positive, nothing has changed. Possession's the same. Still haven't had a shot on target. White back's playing a six. Uh, oh, highlight, highlight. Throw it to a teammate. Oh, Jesus. What is that? <laughs> oh, all the... Oh, everybody stop running to the ball. You don't need six people to run towards the ball. It's not the under eights. Oh, that's a good block. Push him back, push him back. Good block. That's better defending, boys. Another corner, though. Come on. Defend it. Counter attack. Easy for Finley. Watch this, going to come straight back. <laughs> get out. Oh, ref! Referee! Don't, don't. Get off the line. You're going to take it out of play. Come on, shot on target. That's all I'm caring about now. Shot on target. Jared, 6.8. Okay, fair enough. 1 0 down and a 6.8 is actually not too bad. Okay, we're going to bring on a bit more pace. Going attacking. I'm going to go show some passion. Boys. Form is starting to look ropey. We have... Have we been better the second half? It's hard to tell. <laughs> it's like comparing shit to another lump of shit. It's hard to tell which is the better shit. No shots on target. That's a shocker there, lads. Against second from bottom. <laughs> Okay, might start thinking about a new tactic here, boys. Ooh. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Harvey Rogers played a 7.1 7 at centre-back. That's pretty decent. Okay, fine. Be like that. Oh, what have we got? Poor form. Scott Brown's injured. Three days. Thank God for that. He said foot injury. Ankle. I'll take it. Fans criticise Doki tactics. Favourites relegation. Tenth in the league. Fuck off, fans. That's how I'm saying to that. I'll go I'll full on Jose Mourinho over that. Okay. Oh, my God. Jared. You had two games off. <laughs> what? How much of a rest? You're 21. 22 now. You're 22 years old. I feel like you should be playing every week. I'm disappointed in this, lad. Got to be honest. Oh, what is, what's wrong with you? What do you want? I feel like I deserve a new contract. Do we? Oh, do I get him to offer him a new... He's not very good. No, I'm going to gamble. Okay, six without winning, boys. I think we need to just change it up. Even if it's just a short-term solution, you know, play a 4-4-2 or play something different just to mix it up a little bit. Maybe it's got a bit stale. Maybe we've been figured out a little bit. But like I said, before these two games, like Brighton was fine. Before the Gillingham game, I felt like we played really well. So it's tough. It's tough. I might stick with it for Carlisle because it's a league trophy game. I'll give it, I'm going to give it these two more games because I don't want to jump too early. It's been working for us. So, Right, we're going to end the episode there. Didn't get massively far, but we've, we've signed a player. We, we tried to sign new contracts that didn't work. Other than that, it's going brilliantly. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.